Hey, what's up, guys? This is Dom from MacMixing.com. Just bringing you another quick uh, iOS tutorial. It's been brought up to me a couple times. Uh, people are wondering, uh, they keep asking me, oh, what do you see when I send you an iMessage? Do you see my number or my email? And then the following question always is, well, how do I change it to one or the other? You know, either how do I change it so you see my email, or how do I change it so you see my number? And, well, there's a uh, there's a couple ways of doing this. The first way, uh, the easiest way, well, I mean, I guess they're both easy, but the obvious way would be to add the person that's messaging you as a contact and then you'll see their name, whatever name you set for them in, in your contacts as the message that they send you. But there's another way to do it to where you can either have the email or the phone number. You can specify which one you want, and I'm going to show you how to do that here real quick. So what you want to do is you want to go into settings and then uh, you want to scroll down to messages here. Go into messages. And uh, obviously I have iMessage turned on. I have MMS turned on. Group messaging on. Whatever. Uh, there's a portion in here that says receive at. It's gonna, and it says three addresses right now. Well, if I go there, um, I have my Apple ID at the top. I have my phone number, which is blurred out. Sorry, you guys. And then I have my two email addresses here. And uh, what you can do is, oh, look at this, I actually got a, an iMessage from somebody, somebody asking me a question. Anyways, um, what you can do here is uh, you can add any emails that you want there that are yours, and then you can uh, go into caller ID, and you can specify what they see when they send you a message. Well, like again, this is my phone number up here that's blurred out, then I have my two email addresses right here, and I can change what them to see whatever I want when they send me a message. So that's pretty cool and that's how you can change the caller ID of your iMessaging. Or like I said, um, if you wanna change it on your end and you don't care what their end is, you can just add them as a contact and, uh, and it'll show up just like that. And you know what, thank you guys so much uh, for supporting the channel and watching my videos. I really appreciate it a lot. Uh, also, uh, please subscribe, the button's right here. And then uh, follow us on Twitter right here and Facebook right here. And, uh, you know, thank you guys a lot for the support. And uh, I'm having fun teaching you guys all this stuff, and I'm not going to stop. So keep on watching. Thanks again. This is Dom from MacMixing.com. Go check out MacMixing.com. And uh, thank you guys very much. Have a good day.